calling all the lovers out there tonight. Where would I be without weights and pleasures? Where would I be without weights and pleasures? Where would I be without weights and pleasures? up man hey uh what's up nothing dude i feel like uh i'm in Folsom prison man with There's this stupid quarantine it's only freaking what day two yeah it, oh my god <laughs> no, day two i've been kicked out of two gyms dude and like my oh man it's hey, awful please continue that story because i have no idea what happened you haven't talked you don't know about the well story. the first oh, one yeah. these, these, these planet fitness people are, are out of their mind dude let me tell you dude they have the worst attitude. i gotta say shout out to my boy who owns the club over here that I go to that he closed down because for right now he was smart for one dude, you know, and, uh, n number two, dude, like he's not a jerk like at all. So what happened at Planet, Planet, oh, well, Planet Fitness. Fitness? Planet Fitness. I didn't, I, I gave him my credit card and he was like, just putting my card in there. And like she was him. The manager, uh, was like behind him this uh she's like a curly hair broad dude probably her dad's probably like part of the uh, like the crew that wears white hats looking chick you know <laughs> and, of course uh, that was into it okay continue yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> she definitely comes from because she like thought she was like a great person or something anyway i don't care any about that but i was like hey can you like if if you guys have to close down dude like can i get my money back because like i love my gym and i'm not coming here when my gym opens back up i let them know that like right off the bat they're like yeah I got my gym, dude. I got my people, you know, like let them know, like immediately I didn't approve of their club, you know, like, but not with my voice, but with my attitude. <laughs> 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 okay. So, so like, like I was, you know, I, I let her know. She's like, well, well, how am I supposed to know that? And I told her, I gave her the old, like, you're a mushroom, you know, like, I understand that you're, <laughs> she, I said, okay. I said, I understand, like, you're kind of like a mushroom. They feed you shit. They keep you in the dark. I, I didn't say shit. I said, they feed you a bunch of crap, keep you in the dark. She looked at me. She's like, I don't like that analogy at all. And I was like, oh, well, let's not spiral. <laughs> <laughs> so she didn't like that. You know, she she didn't like that. Uh, I wasn't trying to be, like, mean, but I was like, oh, I understand. Like, you're basically just a manager, like, of a club. Like, you're, like, you're nobody. <laughs> like, I kind of, like, told her that. Because she was giving me attitude. And look, I'm not smoking. Okay? So, Fed. I mean, I don't know if Nancy knows th this part of me as well as you do, dude. Mm -hmm. But I think you can vouch that when um, when when we... If you, if you come at me just with a little bit, I can read a person very well. Especially when I'm not stoned. I can read a person like a map. You know? And then I could pretty much be like, oh, dude, this person's trying to do this, this, and this, dude. You know? And, like, immediately mm -hmm. I knew her attitude. You know? And um, I think you can vouch for that, right? Yeah. I can, I can read people pretty uh, So anyway, dude, like, I get out of there and I'm like, whatever, dude. Like, I'm, I'm leaving, dude. Like, I, I, just, like I, I gave the guy my credit card, but pulled it back, dude. I was like, dude, you guys are worthless, dude. So I'm going to go to a different club, dude. So I went to uh, – because it wasn't going to happen. So I went to this village uh, – Fitness. It's called, it's called the village. Whatever they call it, dude. I don't even know. And like, when I joined, the dude was hella cool. The dude with the beard, man, awesome dude, bro. He kind of looks like, uh, I don't know. He kind of looks like a, a, a grabbler, but he seems pretty cool. Uh, and anyway, you know, he signed me up, dude. Like, th that was cool. But then the next day, like, the first workout, dude, was pretty cool. Like, the people are way more stuck up. Like, uh, you know, you, you've been I there. told you. I they're way you. more stuck up. Never they been there. They, dude, they think they're great. And they're all on like steroids. Right. Oh, all on, right. It's I, the designer gym. No. Yeah, it's like the designer. Yes, exactly. Uh, yeah. So they spend $30 a month, which is my, like, my gym's more than that. You know? Mm -hmm. And it's like, dude, like your $30 is amazing. And my gym's way better. Like, way, dude, don't, you guys don't want to like come there if you guys are listening from Village. You guys can stay at your gym. But our gym is like way better. <laughs> anyway, so the next day I come back and, and it's like 10 a.m. Okay. And like they haven't opened yet. And 
like they have a sign, and I I call Fed and I'm like, dude, look at this sign. That's I'm talking I'm talking to Fed. So Fed knew the attitude I was in. I don't I was I was a little bit uh, pumped. Yeah, up. you're pissed because you wanted them to at least shoot you an email or a text nowadays. It's easy to right, right, right. send your have, members, you know, something. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they didn't do that, you know. And then like the bearded guy comes in, cool dude. He's like, what's up, everybody? No problem. But then like the general manager came in, dude. This this Asian dude. Like, definitely, uh, allegedly, definitely, allegedly on steroids, dude. And, like, he thought he was tight, you know? Mm -hmm. And he's, like, he's trying to tell everybody how we're going to get down with the, with the germ rules so they can stay open. And, like, I'm, look, I'm listening. And, like. Is he announcing this to everybody? Like, yeah, everybody's, like, everybody. huddled up? To like everybody. before everybody's walking yeah, in or everybody. everybody's, to, to everybody's everybody. walking in and they're huddled up? Yeah, yes, exactly. Then he okay. has a clip. Right, uh -huh, and he's uh -huh. like, you just have to write your name on here, and like he's talking like this. You have to write that my hair, and he's talking like that, like that, like that. You know, he's talking like that, <laughs> and he's like, um, and the guy behind me goes, "Hey man, maybe you should like get us different pens or something like that." And right. I was like, "Yeah, dude, like we don't want coronavirus." It's like and I looked out, dude, because he he was giving us all hell of attitude already. Like his his uh, you know, I'm dude. You guys know I got Asian folks. What I'm gonna tell you something about them. They have this complex a lot of the times. Oh, now you're Facebook. Hold on, Facebook. just listen. It's not bad. <laughs> they're, they're, they're like, they're special boys or precious boys, okay? And I grew up with a lot of Asians. It's not a slant, but their moms tell them how special and how precious they are. And so he's like a special boy, a precious boy. He's mommy's precious little boy. Uh, <laughs> so, like, he never had anybody tell him, dude, to, like, how to do his job, obviously, dude. He probably uh, allegedly took it up the rear end or whatever to the owner or something. I don't know, allegedly. Oh, uh, okay. So anyway, dude, he uh, he gets mad at me, dude. He's like, well, if, if you want to approach me, come approach me later. I said, okay, dude, I'll come approach you later. I started to lift him, dude, get him my lift on, dude. And like he comes up to me and he's like, and the first thing I say to him, guys, is like, dude, I thank you. I know, I thank you, dude. I know you're working hard. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the first thing I tell him, dude. And then he's about to say, dude, you're upsetting other members of a, of a that. I was like, dude, I can say whatever I want outside. Just, I wasn't even in the club. You can't tell me what I could tell people outside, dude. What were you saying outside? I was talking on the phone to you. Did I say anything that bad? No. Okay, I thought you were just, you know, being, you know, goofy no. outside, saying stuff no, outside. No, no, when no, we no. Got I was just phone. saying, dude, that I was, I was critiquing it with you on the phone. Oh, like we okay. do at the gym. Right. Okay? So they were, they were listening into my conversation, being uh -huh. nosy, bad people already, uh -huh. you know? And... So, like, dude, he puts his hand on me. He's like, you got to go, okay? And I screamed at him. I'm like, dude, we have coronavirus going on right now, dude, and you're touching me? You know? <laughs> he's such an ass. <laughs> no, 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 no. But then but then he's like, he, he, he tried to puff up his chest at me, you know? And I was like, bro, it was, and I shouldn't have said this, and I'm sorry for saying it. <laughs> I was like, hey, dude, like, it was your people that caused this, dude, not mine. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> It is called. He didn't like that. Chinese. He didn't virus. like that. Then he like took off his jacket like he was gonna fight me. But then he walked behind the counter. And he's like, "Well, well, well, let's go outside." Then he like steps behind his like meathead like personal trainers. You know, like, mm -hmm. oh, dude, like there's five of us, dude, and we're gonna whoop you. And like, mm -hmm. I'm I'm ready. Like yeah. for me, that's a fair fight. They have no idea, dude. Mm -hmm. They have no idea. They think it's a game. But like, I'm like, dude, like, if I lose, I'll take my car. And like, what? What? Don't even worry, dude. Don't even worry. Like, I, and like, I'm stepping outside, ready. You know, and yeah. he's like yelling at at his like 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 behind the counter, like he's gonna do something, dude. And so I'm kicked out of that gym now too. That's just the story, you know. <laughs> like, I'm not saying I'm innocent, you know, but it's truthful. And people come yeah. to the show for truth. They don't come for lies. And like, every day we learn and we make mistakes. And I probably shouldn't have said that. To him. <laughs> But I was just watching Trump's speech, dude, and he called it the China virus. They're like, because what that's I what it is. I'm really upset that you're calling it Corona, man. Yeah, why? No, you used to love it. <laughs> <laughs> Today I went to the hardware store and I was putting in my information, and they're like, What's your last name. I was like, Oh, you're gonna love it. <laughs> and, <laughs> so, Corona. I was like, people used to love it. He's like, Oh, I like the beer. I was like, you know, crappy ass beer as it is. But I said, you know, uh, <laughs> I said, yeah, now people, you know. Turn their nose down to him, and they hate it. They hate my last name, so I'm I'm all for calling it the. the Why don't you change your last name to Segebi, dude? There we <laughs> go. It's in Segebi. <laughs> right, you say it means comet. 
Yeah. Well, so what's going on with your guys' workout? Dude, that was a long spiel for me. And if if the guy is listening, dude, but she's like, I, I, oh I yeah, it. I'm sure he's yeah, I'm sure he's a <laughs> long time listener. You know, I mean, not my bad, dude, but like, you're cool, dude. You're cool. It's fine. Dude. Oh, but no, forget that guy, dude. Because I would have been that same way of, you didn't say anything wrong to him, you know? I mean, besides, you know, he's going to get that offended because you said, you said, oh, you're the I reason. I would rather somebody say something to me, dude, and then we'd be cool because I know how he really feels. And then but that even, way we can really start on even ground. But even though you came out and you and you thanked him for the hard work that he was putting in, right? right was, absolutely. Like, All so my children's lives. He should have been squashed right there. Well, he was but on he, steroids. Yeah, okay. Well, he was on steroids, dude. So half of me wanted to be like, dude, I'm going to knock you out even you're on, even though you're on steroids, allegedly. Allegedly. <laughs> I didn't say his, I didn't say his name. I've been really good at saying not say his name, so it doesn't even matter. Right. And I didn't even say the right gym. Yeah, you okay. did. did yeah, you so, no, and I didn't, I didn't how did say you do on that competition? Uh, I didn't have something in fourth. You can't. This oh, you can't in fourth. This could be okay. a comedy show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and now, anyway, I but, uh, in stores. What's going on with your boy? So, what's up with you, Fed? What did you do? I uh, yesterday I did shoulders, and I had some bands, and I was using those, and I don't know where these bands came from, but I found them, and you know, you could put there's like these handles to them, so you can clip, you know, multiple bands to the handles to have, add a little bit more resistance. So as soon as I started doing shoulder presses, I got to like the third one, and they all just snapped. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I was not happy. I was not happy. So I had a really light workout. Did, did it hurt you when it snapped you? Dude, that's a lawsuit. I don't even know where these bands came from. Oh, I, I thought they came from the bottom. Okay, okay. <laughs> I thought no, maybe no. you just like went to Ross and bottom, dude. No, like, I dug them up somewhere. I dug them up somewhere, but I did yeah. purchase some new bands that are coming in the mail. So Yeah, um, but they're I'm not look, coming I'm... anytime quick. That's what sucks. Well, you did an Amazon. I... I paid two days shipping. <laughs> it comes in. And <laughs> hey, your stupid virus did cause this. There's no oh shipping. It's two days. I'm like, this is only day two of not going to the gym, and I'm going insane. Yeah, so uh, you I know what I've, been doing? I've been fasting, dude. Like, I've been fasting. My diet's been really good. I've been doing the battle ropes outside, so I have a rope, so I've been doing a little stuff like that, and I've been, you know, walking around with a weighted vest in the morning, so, you know, what do about- some... No, you know, you know what Nancy did. What I'm, what, remember, I'm an expert at Nancy. All right, what what she do? <laughs> Nancy built a big old fancy gym, dude. Wow, it's not big. It's no fancy gym. It's not a big. Is old it like gym. the Rock? <laughs> Have you seen the Rock gym? The Iron Man, the one he travels yeah. with, is bigger than that. That's what I imagine it to be. Yeah, it's gigantic. That's yeah. what I imagine. It has everything wow. you could imagine. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding, Nancy. For real, what do you got in there? <laughs> So I went and bought a big Olympic, the Olympic bar, seven, the seven foot bar, you know, and then I bought some weights to go on that. And then I bought the landmine thing to go with it. And then I bought some weights, uh, some hand weight dumbbells, 20 and 25. But that's the thing. I ordered them at Amazon and now Amazon's saying, unless it's a priority where, you know, that's not. And I'm like, mother. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's not what you said when I ordered it. I know. I was ready to go purchase those Bowflex Select Tech dumbbells. Yeah. But they only go up to like 50 pounds. It doesn't, it doesn't do anything for you. No, I just want to say, I'm not going to spend $500 so my, on this. My thing. new kick is okay, dude, I got the bike ready, dude. I'm going to bike. I'm going to bike, walk, and swim every day, dude. And I'm going to swim in the lake in a wetsuit. And like, that's the end of it. Did you get a new wetsuit? Um, today, dude, I kind of just like, uh, spiraled in my room. I was a little bit upset today. I don't know why I almost got <laughs> into the despair zone, dude. And like, oh, uh, that's not good. No, you gotta stay it's out. Of it. It's why? Awful. Why? 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 Because I don't like what's going on. I don't like, uh, having everything, uh, it feels like my, uh, schedules being taken away from me, my normalcy. Yeah. And like every time, like like with the uh, divorce, the fire, all these things, dude, it always takes away my normalcy. And that's like the hardest part for me is to like stay on. Like I put a lot of work in to lifting. I put a lot of work in to, you know, my other businesses into the show, all that. I mean, I don't put a lot of work in it. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I feel you. Yeah, I'm like a creature of habit too. And I'm so used to, you know, getting up early and getting my routine and doing my thing, you know, and 
Now I'm waking out of bed. I'm like, man, I'd be coming home from the gym already at this time, you know, at 7 30, 8 o'clock in the morning. And I'm like, I'm just starting my day <laughs> doing nothing. Right. Well, so I'm just getting up and starting my workout like I normally would. I'm not changing anything. And, you know, you had that weighted vest and stuff like that. You know, you could create something in your own. You know, I just you hate step working up. Out. I hate I know, but you out. have to. You oh, no, have, I'm going to. I yeah, oh, no. Myself. No, I'm definitely doing. I have my music blaring and stuff, and so you know I'll get it in. But it's just it's just going to the gym and being in that atmosphere and really getting your workout in. When there's at home, there's so many distractions, you know. Yeah. No, I go in the room and shut the door, blare the music. Yeah, like the P90X. That's a good home workout. Yeah, I like the Insanity workout too. Yeah, those are all like great. Dude. You get yeah, work, you get a you get a workout. But yeah, I mean, I like to lift the, all I, cardio. Right. I like well. That's and they, exactly. So if I'm gonna do all cardio now. Then it's time to do all cardio, so I'll I'll run, bike, and swim. Trying to get lean, man. Yeah. yeah. Ugh, sounds horrible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. Think about you know, it. I, ne I never in my life was like, "Hey, dude, I want to be hella skinny and lean." Like, <laughs> you want to be hella skinny? <laughs> lean out a little bit. How long do you think this is going to go on for? Oh, the rest of our lives. It's over, dude. <laughs> I'm not trying to tell you. Where you're at. That's what I asked you before we started this show. I asked you if you're going to go on a rant. You're going on no. a rant. <laughs> no. This is not. Okay. No. How long do you think, Nance? I'm going to give it a month. Exactly. And I think things will start going back. Uh, they, like the, China's just getting a second wave, is what they're saying. Really? <laughs> really? That's not what I heard. That's not what I heard either. <laughs> yeah. Just start guys, guys, now I see that there's a cure and vaccines and all these things. And me, I, I'm, I'm just not doing it. They said that the cure for it or the, or the vaccination for it is the same thing they use to treat malaria. But yeah. So, I mean, obviously, it's <laughs> awful. <laughs> well, you don't have any symptoms, so you don't have to worry about it. Me? No, I don't. <laughs> but you know they're gonna want you to get the vaccine they're gonna want you to vac vaccinate your children oh yeah this is gonna... vaccine show and I, oh you know. i'm not gonna be forced to do there's where you'll have a problem you can't right. force me to do anything i'm not gonna get it i can't get it so. uh, next time you're at the doctor and they ask you if you want to do vaccines be like hey i would love to do the vaccine now can you sign a waiver that says if anything happens as a result of these vaccines you are liable they won't do it right they won't do it <laughs> Like, what? <laughs> you're crazy. We're like, dude, you're crazy. You won't even like back up your vaccine, and this is my body. I get, I get a warranty, dude. When I buy a fishing pole, dude, this is my body. You're putting something into my body. <laughs> <laughs> so they, they uh, legally, well, by law now here in Sacramento County, by midnight tonight, it's you're only allowed outside to go anywhere unless you're going to the grocery store or to the doctors or to to work if your job is still open other than that you can no longer go anywhere be anywhere you can take your dogs out for a walk you can go to the park if you like but you have to be six feet away from anyone it's yeah i mean we're in a kind of socialist country now it's kind of cool so, we're gonna yeah, start getting thousand so dollars we're gonna get thousand dollar checks i heard it was gonna be 1200 yeah oh, well, but you, got, you, oh, you, got kids you guys have read the fine print it's only for people you can't what was it my husband's in the back. Tim, <laughs> what was the thing? Hi, Tim. Yeah. 120000 adjusted gross income, individual 240 or no. No, what is the gross income for getting a check? 120000 120000 No. Okay. My information isn't coming in good. This is bad. This is bad. It's going down. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Change the channel. <laughs> Yeah, that was bad. Didn't happen. Again. Anyway, I mean, I, I, you know, will you yeah. guys take the check? Yeah. We want. We'll get what Tim estimated for us is we'll get like two hundred dollars. <laughs> we'll, we'll, wow. Yeah. Nice, dude. That's that's definitely that's some a pair of socks nowadays. <laughs> yeah, you can go buy some more weights with it. A yeah, nice. True. You know. It's a good little two hundred bucks for some weights. I used to have before the house burned down in my house, dude. There was a it was a nice home gym, dude. You did have a nice little one setting up, man. You had some old yeah. school equipment in there, and it was good. I used to have some nice equipment too, but got rid Speed of all bag, of it. The punching bag, uh, dumbbells, 
a bar. And the best thing, though, is I had that grip machine, man. Yeah, I like that grip machine. That That's grip like. machine helps you get like a gorilla, dude. I like that like grip a gorilla. machine. Gorilla? <laughs> uh, Nets, I used to know a guy. He used to be able to take quarters and rip them in half with his finger. Oh. And I was like, dude, how did you do that? And he just, like showed me the machine. Oh, it was a machine. <laughs> no, we got it. Well, no, no, to no, get no, stronger. No. As far as to get stronger. To like get your, your hand grip strong. He could like grab people. He was a, a security guard for a biker club. He could like grab people by the arm and like squeeze it hard enough to break the bone. Oh, that's a good. Yeah. Trick to have. Yeah. So people would really, once he would like just grab them really hard, they, they would know that, oh, this dude's got more power than I can really handle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Are you so, uh, besides despair, what's, what's <laughs> going on? Despair. <laughs> that's my word. Uh, nothing, dude. Everything's shut down. There's nothing going on besides NFL, right? Are you but, watching I mean, movies? Are you watching movies? No, I've been watching just NFL free agency crap. That's what about it. you, Nets? What are you watching? Movies? Um, well, I try not to watch TV till like two, three o'clock. So your house so. is spotless. No, it's not. I need to clean. That's my problem. No, because I've been working out and then I go for a walk and stuff. So I've been trying to. I try to you stay with out, my regiment. Walk. There's an hour. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be surprised how fast the day goes. I've been working on Gabe's car, you know, yeah. helping him, you know, and the day all of a sudden I look up, I was like, holy crap, it's two o'clock already. You know, right. I've been out there since, you know, eight o'clock, nine o'clock, you know. Is this car, how's that car looking? It's coming along. What is kind it, of car is it? It's, uh, Cressida. he's going to get mad at me if I Cressida. mess up the year. Yeah, I know. I know it's a Cressida, but I want to say 91. Don't even get yourself involved in the year. <laughs> oh, never mind. Yeah. I love it. It's like a, it, it's like a little community of Cressidas that he belongs to now. Oh. And so they show him and he does all these things to it. And his buddy hooked oh. him up with a cool engine. So he's swapping the engine out. Oh, cool. So I have two engines in my garage now with the car. So there goes my room for any kind of gym. Yeah, but at least your son is a good son staying home with you. Oh, that's no, awesome. that's good. We, we have a good time besides, you know, yelling at him earlier. Yeah, tonight, I mean, but... me too, dude. I'm having a good time with my kids too. I take, <laughs> I take him to the park now. We go play basketball. Like, you know? I wish I could go swimming. Hmm? I wish my pool was hot enough to go swimming. Oh, a few more weeks, right? Uh, when do you guys usually start swim season? May? Yeah, about May. End of May. End of May. Ooh. Yeah. Not okay. not for Emilio. Emilio's beginning of May. He just he jumped in last week. Oh, did he? <laughs> yeah. <coughs> also, he came out in his swim trunks. I was like, "What are you doing?" He's like, "I'm gonna jump in." So he jumped in. I was like, "All right." Yeah. He, he doesn't he doesn't get bothered by the cold. Yeah. Lily wanted me to take wants me to take her when I go to the lake. You know. Uh-huh. And I say, last time he that's jumped cool. in. Uncle... That's, that's what I told her. I said, "Last time you you went in Uncle Edson's pool, you came out of that pool and you were like, I can't breathe." <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> yeah. I can't breathe that. <laughs> okay, baby, you relax. Uh, that time that that Jay and I went to go visit you, I wonder what when was it? What time of the month it was? I want to say it was around this time. And when we went, and we went to that lake also, and she jumped in. She. That's what I. I know. There's something going on. Where she's getting weak. Hmm. Like hanging out. I'm, I think she's hanging out with my mom too much. Oh my gosh. Because <laughs> when she hung out with just me, dude. I have a picture, Fed, of her, right? And there's uh-huh. a glacier melting into mm-hmm. a lake, and she's swimming, dude. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what? I think I've seen that. Right. Yeah, I think I've seen that. And I want to say I even took a video of her when we went to that lake, and she was swimming. I was like, man, it's cold in there. And she right. was all up and swimming. Oh, that was? You did come with us that time. Yeah. Yeah. She was swimming, dude, like nothing. I was like, it's cold. <laughs> yeah, dude. She's Because they... I, I let them roam in Montague on that hill mm-hmm. and be free range, and <laughs> it was cold, man. Uh huh. It's all it's freezing up there. People don't understand. They're like, oh, you're from California. I'm like, no, bro, I'm from the hills, California. It's cold. <laughs> yeah. You know, it'll kill you that wind. It's like so cold and dry over there. Mm-hmm. It's a way different area than Medford. Like, it, you can't believe just 45 minutes what a difference it makes. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost un. If you if. If there was no house there, it'd be almost uninhabitable. You know, if there's not a structure to be in or something, like the wind is so fast, like a tent wouldn't make it. I wouldn't think so, yeah. Nothing like that makes it. Gazebos, dude, don't make it out there. Tents don't make it. Uh, they would all just 
<laughs> blow over a giant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So 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 you're saying a month, it goes yeah. back to normal dance. What are you I saying? No, it starts gradually starting. No, because we're, we're betting. Yes, I was just gonna say over under. So oh. Nancy, you set the line at four weeks. We're way over four weeks to do this. It's normal. I could, because they're not even going to uh, send the kids back to school now, they're saying, until, like, next year. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Some say, think schools are thinking of canceling the whole, the rest of the academic year. So what does that yeah. mean? That means that your kids year? have to go to school again. I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Are they going to set on some kind of program? Because these kids got to graduate. Seniors, you know, they yeah. got to they gotta move on. Um, yeah. And look, I, I, I'm not saying this for sure, but I imagine if they do this now, I'm not sending my kids back to any school because it makes me realize how much um, authority and how much I depend on the school. I don't like it at all. So you're going to homeschool? I have to. If if they can't get this back to normal in a few weeks, too, it, like and the kids don't go back to school, why would I send them into school again? They're telling me school is that dangerous that they have yeah. to shut down for a virus. That's how dangerous it is. Like kids get, I mean, I'm not doing it. I'm not going on a rant. I'm not going on a tirade. Kids get murdered in schools, dude, like straight up shot. And they don't it's do crazy. anything yeah. about it. It's sad. Anything. It's sad. I'm happy to mine homeschool. So it's, it's, it's like normalcy over here for us, right? Because they, they're used to it. They've been used right. to it now, and it, it's all good. They're continuing their schooling, and they're still going to be ahead, and they're going to be done, you know? Um, but Daniel, he's, you know. No, Daniel will graduate. Da Daniel oh, no, he'll, he'll graduate. I'm just saying they're, they're going to find, you know, it's just, it just sucks because he wants, he's like, these kids want to get back to school, you know? Yeah. Well, it's, you know, at the university level now, it's like everything. Yeah, like, it's everywhere. Like our, Dr. V or Dr. Inc. Uh, he uh, said most of his classes are going to uh, uh, are online. online. Yeah. Uh huh. But well, I don't understand. The like, other... they're, they're supposed to. Everybody's supposed to be separated, right? Or, or you know, what is it called? Practice social distancing. Uh -huh. Is that what they called it? But all these stores are mass hiring people. Right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, truck drivers, guys. Truck do? drivers. Man. <laughs> Truck driving, grocery truck driving, store. Truck yeah, it's like, oh my gosh. I mean, thank God for Sarah's work too, for her being in the grocery you know business. Much, you know, that she's in the guys... office. Go ahead, finish. Well, I'm just saying that, thank God. I mean, because the grocery business is still going, you know, she's not oh, shut right. down. Great time to she's be still going. So, going. so she still has to, yeah. and she can work from home if it gets that serious, but oh. they still have to keep going. So she could, you know, it's right now in the office, it's just her and I believe maybe like two other, three other people with her. Um, but you know, she can work from home if she likes, but thank God, like I said, that, you know, her job is still functioning at, you know, and we're still I, getting paid. I, I, like, like truckers, right? There's nobody on the road now. So the truckers can like go. So they're probably making the most money they ever made. Yeah. They're smashing. Yeah. Cause they're not even like in the Bay. They don't even have to sit in traffic, dude. And they get paid per mile. Yeah. I know. Sure think of that. Yeah. Lot. So they're probably just getting dough. And that's the thing, these idiots. I mean, there's enough food. There's not. We're, there's no shortage of food, and there's no shortage of toilet paper. I mean, we're making it a, shor a shortage. The only thing you know? there's a short of a shortage of right now, guys, is good old fashioned love. <laughs> I mean, honestly, <laughs> people are. It really is. You're right. Crazy. <laughs> You're right. People are crazy. Yeah. I right. I I just I can't understand. Like, you know who's nor who's been uh, really been the nor most normal people. Honestly, it's the people who walk in, like Nance. You see people walking their dogs, the same ones who are like, I'm going to stay normal, just keep walking right. my dog. Yeah, I saw, I saw some runners today. my macchiato. Yeah, I saw some like, runners today running, you know, through the neighborhood. You know. Are you going to pick up, are you going to get a wetsuit too, dude, or no? Probably not. You're going to, you're just going to let your body rot? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to start doing hella burpees again. Oh. You know? Right now, it's becoming like, do we might as well just be in prison? <laughs> oh my god! Right? It's like, it's like, well, free food, water, clothes, electricity. <laughs> the, right? There's actually people there you can talk to with interesting stories. It's like, damn, roam, roam around in though. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's true. Well, dude, like, oh man, <laughs> they, give you, they give you yard time at least. 
Yeah. <laughs> like, like, but they're Trump releasing hella like, people. And I like too. Trump, guys, but he doesn't even want to save yard time, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you saw well, Gavin Newsom wanted to call in that giant, sh- the medic ship to uh, uh, Los Angeles. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's how bad LA is getting, man. I never thought. I never thought that all those homeless people would make a, like disease spread. You know, I thought it'd be just fine. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what are they thinking, right? They're like yeah. shelter, like shelter in place, dude. What if you're homeless? Right, <laughs> they're not. It's a free for all for them now. Yeah, oh, well, he was right. saying that he was gonna. There were like 900 hotels that were opening up for the homeless people. There was and abandoned cruise ships and uh, some other stuff. I was like, oh, now they're gonna try to do something. <laughs> Put them on the cruise ships, and the oops, it somehow got loose. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, like e- everyone, like there's a lot of like just like dumb madness. Like, p- like the gym is close. Like they change, like not my gym, but these other gyms. Like they change their hours, dude. Like this coronavirus, like sleep. <laughs> like, they're like, oh, we can only open up from like 10 a.m. to like 5 p.m. now. Yeah, but then can't they have so many people in there? Yeah, that's the thing. Like, there's right. another gym. So what? That's exactly right. They should be opening the more hours. Yeah, there's a gym out in Sacramento. I want to say downtown. There's a small, small gym. And he just says, we people are coming at their own risk. He's all, we got to keep it open because people's immunity still needs to, their, own, their immune system still needs to, we need, people need to work out. That's how you stay healthy, you know? And yeah. so he's all, our group classes are, are small now. You know, they're, we, we limit them, but people come in and they clean it, take out, you know, take care of themselves and clean up the gym when they're done and they move on, you know, but at least they're staying open. I don't know how, yeah. but and then all, all of a sudden, dude, I'm seeing the people who like, like, like the ones who like don't clean the equipment and get shit on everything. And like, dude, they're the scared ones. I'm like, dude, mm-hmm. you're like the dirtiest one at the gym and yeah. you're going to, you're going to like be scared. Yeah. yeah. But just like, I got to say, there's something like, so you guys know my mom lived in Iran and my family mm-hmm. comes from Iran. Mm-hmm. Uh, and my like, my mom moved over there after, because she's, you know, of course, a Caucasian lady, you know, uh, Danish, you know, strong genetics on that side. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, she had to live there and she was like, like, it doesn't affect my parents at all, just like it doesn't affect your mom, Fed, you were talking about, you know? Mm-hmm. My mom was like, oh, we had to wake up at like 2 a.m. to do laundry for like an hour, and then we had to like hang our laundry in the dark, you know? Mm-hmm. And so she's like, they would just shut off our electricity in a place, dude, that's 110 degrees during the day. <laughs> it's, dude, it's next to Iraq. My, yeah. my, my mom lives in Iran. It's literally like Baghdad, you know? Mm-hmm. Right mm-hmm. next to Iraq, and it's a uh, awful place to be and they would like shut down the electricity so for her it was like eh, it's all just gonna be okay you know right i was gonna say to my mom it's like hey they had no electricity in their village where they lived no windows everything was just cut out on the side of their house and you know same thing having to walk heck of far just to get water from the river to wash their clothes and carry the wet clothes back all the way back to the river so they can you know back to the village so that the clothes can dry you know, and, and just a little bit of meat, and they had to share it between all her siblings, and she's like, this is nothing. <laughs> no, exactly, dude. You know? Like, come there on. There was that dude. meme. What was that a meme white that you've seen? Dude, a what white was that woman meme that Iran? you saw? Have you seen that meme on Facebook that said, like, your grandfathers were asked to go to World War II, and, and now you're just being asked to sit on the couch? I think you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't seen that one. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think oh, you'll be able to handle that one. Not get me started. Why did you bring up World War II? Do not bring that kind of stuff up to me. Dude, I'm a loose cannon on that kind of stuff, man. Don't even get me started. Uh-huh. <laughs> don't even get me started. Uh, yeah, dude. So uh, it's been like uh, a week of adjustment again, man. Like, I hope it's going to get better. I, I, I really do. And like, I'm, I'm, So I'm thinking way over a month, though. I'm mm. thinking way over a month. But I don't even want to be an agent of despair. But... Half of me really likes it. Like, I love being home with my kids, dude. I love having my kids around me, like, for one, you know? Mm-hmm. I like the fact that people are going to have to force to do ingenious things, like people lifting. Like, I was, I put it on my Facebook thing. People are, like, lifting weights in barns now. You know, there's going to be mm-hmm. a new 
Schwantz opening up underground clubs. <laughs> Dude, this is going to be an awesome time, dude. We'll be talking about probably till we die. <laughs> you know, remember that time, dude? We all thought we were going to die and dumbass was fire lit. You know? uh, yeah. One of those it's, times. That's what we got to go do, but Sai, is go to your property and build like some underground stuff out there, man. So we yeah, can build have... a bunker. Let's build yeah, a bunker. Yeah, we can have a speakeasy out there, man. Yeah. <laughs> we can do like the, the Cayenne West or whatever. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> The whole church out there. We can do that. Oh, do, do you guys think do you guys think Tom Hanks has really got the disease or it's a fake? Uh, they say now he's feeling better all of a sudden. All of a sudden Tom Hanks is feeling better. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. I don't pay attention to that crap. He's ready to come home. Yeah, I mean I don't know, dude. I think uh I thought he was gonna die. You thought he was gonna die? Yeah, I really did. I really from the bottom of my heart, I I was thinking he was gonna die. Who? Tom oh, Hanks. And how would you feel about that? You don't want me to say, stop playing. Because if I get into <laughs> it, it's going to be like, oh, dude, you're paranoid. You think Tom Hanks allegedly is a pedder ass. <laughs> because, guys, there is I a girl. Thought, you know, I had, to, I had to actually go back and listen. Because I thought you said Tom Cruise. So I was uh, Cause oh. that, I'm like, so I was like, uh huh, and then I hear Tom Hanks, yeah. and I'm like, what the? Yeah. So Tom, yeah, Tom Tom Cruise, dude, is definitely yeah got some weird things going right. on with him. I guarantee, I guarantee, allegedly. The other one, that. I'm not so. Sure. I don't, I don't know about that. So, dude, and ho- you have to be a pervert or molested to be in those movies. That's the bottom <laughs> line. If you guys don't think they were running trains on Leonardo DiCaprio. You're you're living in a delusional world, dude. Like the Disney people are perverts. All the signs are literally pedophile signs. Okay, I, I'm sorry. I get this, the kids, that, younger kids. But you were like Tom Hanks. I didn't know where you got that one out. Well, of, Tom so. Hanks. Okay, so Tom Hanks is. Uh, there's a, I forgot her name, but I could find it for you. Uh, oh. But there's a there's no, a young wait, lady. We don't need to get there's into a young lady. I just there's wanted to make lady. that point that I was just didn't, I didn't agree. So, anyways, what no, else? It's not it's not agree. It's <laughs> it's the circumstances of what happened. It's the truth, Nancy. Oh, it's the truth. <laughs> Allegedly. 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 Because, I mean, I know it's it's like a hard place to be because like we watched his movies all the time and like Forrest Gump and he he, he tugged at our heartstrings, but. There is a young lady who said that her dad tr- sold her to Tom Hanks as a sex slave. Mm-hmm. And I, I'm not 100% sure on this, but I believe her father was convicted of that. He actually mm-hmm. got convicted in a court of law for it. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'm, I might, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure about that. And then Maybe there was it was somebody... a guy named Tom Hanks. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, and then, <laughs> listen to this. There, there was another person, and he was a famous uh, YouTuber, and he's, he was in the movie the Terminator Salvation or Terminator something or other. Uh, and he like, came after Tom Hanks and made all these accusations of what, what, what Tom Hanks was doing. Wow. The dude got ran over, ran off of a bridge on Route 66, okay? Mm-hmm. And Tom Hanks like kind of made a jab about it on his Twitter account. Oh, man. And if you follow Tom Hanks' oh. Twitter account, it's oh, creepy God. as hell. He takes pictures of like one glove and like one sock of like a kid's sock at an elementary park. Dude, <laughs> like a, yeah, dude, he's a weirdo guy. I'm telling you, go look at his account. He's weird. He's I, this is not. I've dug into the gravy about Tom Hanks. You know, and I know let's not let's not spiral. Do I know he's your hero and it makes everybody mad? <laughs> How can Cyrus do this? He's from the Bay. Blah, 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 blah. I don't care. I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> what, <laughs> Nancy? Legend. What do you know about uh, what's that thing called, Cy? Si? Androchrome. Androchrome. Oh, Androchrome. How do you say it? Adrenochrome. Adrenochrome. That's what it is. What is that? What are you talking about? You want some of that? What is it? <laughs> That's what Tom Hanks allegedly took. Oh yeah, because. No. Because adrenochrome is they collect uh, the the fear in the blood from a child. They torture a child. They make them scared. And it was in Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. It's an actual real drug, okay? And the drug makes you like hallucinate, like a like 
it doesn't make you hallucinate, but it gives you like the power of like a, a hunter, or it just amps up your adrenaline. Because when you take it, so you 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 panic a kid because they say the kids are, it, it's it's the best blood from a kid, and then you torture them or scare them enough to where you can draw their blood from their spine or from their I want to say their neck, right? And right. Uh, and then you go ahead and drink it, and then you can buy it all on the black market of this blood on, from these kids. I, I, I sent this. And what I is sent it this, supposed to do? Keeps it's you younger. High. Keeps you young. Gets you high. It. Uh, yeah, all the celebrities are taking it. Yeah, if you notice, Justin Bieber's <laughs> looking really bad. If you guys notice right now, Justin Bieber's looking really, really bad, right? Because uh, allegedly, so it's like the it's like Disney, the monster, it, Monsters Inc. The scare, the you scare. That's, uh, the Monsters Inc. is a hundred percent true. Mm -hmm. It's 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 <laughs> it's it's. I know it's like not physical monsters but f from the people in uh who make the movies to the actual monsters you ever see that movie limitless nancy limitless. that's real stuff that's with uh what's that guy's name bradley cooper yeah i like shout out bradley oh. cooper i ain't got no beef with bradley so cooper. they so they take he takes a pill and it yeah. enhances everything right he's yeah. strong oh, yeah. he's faster he can think faster uh -huh. then at the mirror at the very end He's dying because they're running. He's running out of those pills, and he yeah. knew the guy took it, and he he licked his blood at the very end. Oh, it's crazy that these movies, you know, they're making it because these this is what people are doing. Well, I've never heard of yeah. it. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I know because there's it's uh, it's pretty deep stuff, man. And like you're not in like you're it's for you. I don't think do you uh, you don't like gravy. You like dry biscuits, right? <laughs> That's okay. I'm not, I'm no, not I just that don't believe. Me. I don't go looking for. I don't. You know what? I don't have time in this lifetime to constantly look for. <laughs> All the we have is time, dude. I, <laughs> I can't live in that up. negative world. My father was so negative; it was not even funny. So I can't live in that negative world. I can't do it. It all it does is make you. It just eats at you. No, it just eats at you. Like you said I today, that, you, you could get out of your room. You can get out of your room. I say it as truth. I like to find the truth. Yes. <laughs> and the truth can be like sometimes when you find it, it is like a pound of bricks, but it's my oh, yeah. burden <laughs> to keep it away from my kids, yeah. my next generation. Right. If so I'm... don't be so down and dumps and went around your kids because then they sense that and they go, What's going on? Are we really going to have is something? Are we should be scared? Don't let your kids. kids I can't never be let scared. my kids get into a spear spiral. Good. My Good. kids don't fear anything. Good. Their house burned down, you know, and they were yeah. ready to roll together the next day. They yeah. did, dude, they're they're warriors. Good. They're, I gotta say, they're more like Mike Tyson than anything, dude. <laughs> they're they're ready to just go to the next opponent and start yeah. swinging. It's like killing people. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Remember, how, like, hey, cannabis, cannabis, cannabis. <laughs> Check this out, yo. We warriors, baby. We come out fighting, or we don't come out fighting at all. It's like, well, that, make sense. that was perfect. That was perfect. <laughs> yeah, I do I like I, that. Uh, one. I, you know, I met Mike Tyson. I wanted to go. He was he was over here performing at the Grand Sierra on Friday. I'm not, dude. I'm telling you, dude. Mike Tyson is one of the nicest people I ever met. Like as a celebrity wise, like celebrity wise. I'm not. I'm like, you know, I met a few of them. Mm -hmm. Like Jeff Goldblum was a douchebag. Was he? <laughs> Oh, dude, of course. You know who the worst was, dude? And this is first-hand experience. I can't even talk about it because it's against HIPAA. Shit. <laughs> but I had, let me just tell you something. There were some people in L.A. who came into my dispensary and tried to bring a young Asian boy. I had to be like, dog, I don't get down like that, dude. I, I like L.A. and all, dude, but you ain't bringing no kids up in my club, homie. <laughs> yeah, that's, 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 that's all my children. That's a real yeah. talk right there. <laughs> these guys, these guys are perverts, dude. That's how I know it's not like I didn't land on pedophile rock. Pedophile <laughs> rock landed on me. <laughs> <laughs> hopefully, though, ho hopefully, uh, uh, a lot of them, though, a lot of the bad people somehow catch coronavirus. And they right? Die. Like, what if like they all? Of these... hmm? Go ahead. What do you say, Nance? Said you hope. I hope. Oh. Yep. Oh. But I do hope the gym opens because that kills me. <laughs> that would be Are, nice. Like, 
I haven't even like been eating that much because I feel like if I eat, you're just wasting it. Yeah. What, yeah like, I, why do I, I don't even need to eat, dude, because I work out so hard that I need to eat. Like, my no, calorie no. intake was so low the, the last couple of days, man. So you're losing your muscle. So know that. A- absolutely. I, I know. I know. I'm keeping my protein up, but as far as overall calories, it's it's low. My muscle's gone. Oh, you got to keep your protein up. That's all you got to do is keep your protein up. Nah, I'm gonna get I'm gonna I'm gonna get skinny like a monk, get like lean, a monk. Man. Yeah, get heck of skinny. <laughs> like yeah, dude, like one of those uh, dudes that walks around San Francisco with a sh- <laughs> t-shirt tucked in his jeans. <laughs> oh, okay, there we go. That's nice. <laughs> uh, all right. What what else can we bet on, Fed? Dude, you guys want to bet on uh, if they close the state borders? Oh. No, I mean, no, because no one's, tr- you can't travel anywhere unless you're, like, some people were saying they had to go pick up their kid, you know, in Nevada, or they have to go down south to pick up a kid, so you're allowed to do that kind of traveling, but it, it's pretty much already shut so down. So what happens? I'm going to get on I-5, and the co- I'm going to get pulled over? They say, they say, the cops came out today and said that they, they're more, they're not looking for you to you know, to arrest you or to cause you any kind of thing, but they will pull you over or they will stop you outside if you're outside and make it be like a learning lesson, but they, you can get charged with a misdemeanor. That, that means we're trying, uh, all that, I'm, uh, let me give you the translation. That means we want you in our system, give us a reason to pull you over, we're putting you in our system. That's what that means. But I mean, but that's the thing. If not, but the, you're, it's, people are stupid if you're just going to go out. There's nothing open to go unless you're going to the store. Where, oh, there, where I else want to go to the lake. I want to go. I want to go to the lake. I want to go for a bike. Ride. You can you still go me. do that. They say if you can still go to the park and go for a walk as long as it's not a lot of people. Then it's up to you to disperse and and move out the way. Wow. Like all those kids in Florida right now on the beach still. <laughs> you yeah. see those? <laughs> yeah, spring breakers are like we don't Holy care. Crap. Oh, you know, ah, dude, like they're out you know, there <laughs> right now, dude. I'm kind of like envying Florida. I gotta say, the last couple weeks, look, dude, Florida's handling this quite well, dude. No, they're pissed. The lawmakers are pissed, so they'll shut down one beach, and then it's up to another person to shut down the other beach. So all these spring breakers are just moving to the next guys, beach. Guys, this is a country <laughs> of people who jumped on ships, came over here, hopped over mountains, hopped borders, dude. Came through cold, came through snow, came through heat. If you tell us we can't do something, we're gonna do it. Right. It's just in everybody who lives here, white, black, Chinese, it's in their blood, dude. Yep. That's it, dude. Like it's land literally... of the free is the last time I checked. Land well, of the free. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but is that but Not so are, much. are Not so much. and that's <laughs> dance. And that's but. part of like you like we were talking about. Like I I even though I've always been a conspiracy theorist, and I, I, I generally thought that America was free, and and like I'm, that was part of my a little bit of my spiral is that I really, really wah, realized that we ain't free at all, not even a little bit. We're really not. No, they can control you fast. No, they're not fast. They're being control- Yeah, look yeah. how fast they're doing it. Yeah. yeah. So, so that's now, but now I'm over. That's good. So I was like, I'm not. <laughs> like, at least I'm. A, I can like my masters, dude. Whatever, dude. I'm like, what's up, masters? <laughs> How y'all doing? <laughs> Let me get that thousand. Yeah, Nancy, are you nervous that they're gonna shut down your competition? Or are you thinking they will? Well, you know, you're saying four weeks, so you're thinking people are gonna be back on it. Yeah, this is in the. You know, this is Memorial Day weekend, so I haven't. They haven't said anything yet. So if they cancel it, they cancel it. I get my money back. I'm not like I told you. I'm not gonna let it. You know, I'm yeah. still training. Yeah, right. I'm no, that, and that's so the way to be. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's yeah. yeah, yeah. You're an inspiration to everybody. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> I kind of even slipped off, dude. Now tomorrow, dude, for sure, I'm gonna go for a bike ride and a walk. I can't guarantee I can find a wetsuit tomorrow. But if I, can find a... <laughs> I can't guarantee that. That might be hard, bro. Yeah, I'm a dude. I'm a I'm a weird shaped guy. Dude. <laughs> my belly be sticking out. My belly be sticking out. Yo, my belly. Okay. So like, it's just how I am, man. You remember you know when you mean? had that that wetsuit, and then uh, it was right when that Seven Up commercial was coming out with the the truck driver calendar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. <laughs> 
And we used to, Nancy, we used to have Cyrus pose and model at the beach <laughs> in his wetsuit. <laughs> but I, you know, Nancy, I used to be a lot bigger. Oh, we see some of those pictures. <laughs> I used to be a lot bigger. You need to find me some of those. <laughs> yeah, they got everything burned in the everything's burned in the fire. Yeah, that's true. You don't <laughs> no, hear me spot. Right? Edson has some. He'll find some. I gotta have. I have some somewhere. I don't know where. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, gotta, you, gotta, you, you have time. time. You have time. Edson's gone through a lot of things. losses too, dude. But he's not spiraling. You don't even talk about him. Yeah. Oh, we don't even really talk about the real fence, dude. Come on, let's get into some real stuff, Ben. Come on, dude. <laughs> what is this? Man of mystery, dude. The man of mystery. Leave I alone. You've talked about him. You have in the beginning of the show. You want me to oh, tell yeah. you about him from what I know? No. Okay, well. Because <laughs> I want to talk about drones. <laughs> oh, shit. Do you guys, like, they're training officers to use drones? Maybe. I don't see no, why they not. are. Yeah. That's what we're doing. Like, this, this is like like over here in uh in Siskiyou County. This mm -hmm. is County next to ours in California, they were all at the fairgrounds, like learning how to use drones. Wow. Yeah. They can apparently bust a lot more people with drones than with cars. <laughs> I know the, the National Guard is on alert and ready to roll out here in California. For this for for like a cold dude. Like this is amazing. Yeah. People drinking curfew. <laughs> people yeah. people at the stores, you know, acting a fool, you know, stuff like that. Well, yeah, you have all these people acting a fool. You're right. Yeah. I mean, why do we have to? You guys, everybody hoarded all this toilet paper for what? <laughs> oh, dude, I, we didn't hoard nothing, dude. We don't care. Yeah. We don't. We don't, we, I don't roll like that. Store and they, you know, it's just ridiculous. <laughs> just stupid. I, they better have chicken this weekend. You didn't. You still haven't had chicken? <laughs> no, I still got a bunch of turkey breasts, but I like the the thighs right now because they're quicker, a lot quicker to cook. Oh, and, uh, okay. and it has a little bit of the extra fat in it. Oh, you can get and, the thighs here. You can't get the breast here, but you can get thighs. Oh, well, yeah. See, I want some thighs. I mean, I have, like, plenty of breasts. This is like, all... Like, you guys know this is all... America has plenty of food. Oh, and that's what right. I'm saying. And that's what people are telling. There's not a shortage of food. Right. There's plenty to cook I, 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 even, I tried to find a lot of gravy, dude, on America and food. And, like, you can't, dude, because America has a lot... Like, you, like there's some people who have like, outlandish theories, like, all of our grain is gone, but then... Then you actually like go look, dude, and like, there's so much food. There's yeah. so much dairy. Like, it's, so if I'm the president, right? I'm encouraging the pre I'm encouraging everyone to drink dairy, dude, and like have cheese and like break their diet well, a little bit, enjoy ice cream. <laughs> because like, what do we have in this country, dude? Cows and cheese and milk. Mm -hmm. Like, like, dude, like, like, I know it isn't the healthiest, you know, but like in a time of like starvation and like that's what they're worried about. All he's got to do is reassure everybody, guys. Our we we crush the dairy industry. Yeah, we got so much dairy here. Relax, relax. We I can get oh, a geez. gallon of milk to all my citizens <laughs> every day. <laughs> right? We have so much milk. We I would tell everybody the truth. Like we have so much milk, guys. We waste it. We have trucks that go out into the field and just dump it out. <laughs> we have so it's much food. Guys, we have we have so much food. We pay farmers not to grow food. You, you know that. Yeah, I just I just would hope people who are doing it just kick back now, man. Oh, they kick won't. Back. This is a very, like this is a very small group of people who's ruining it for everybody. I would say maybe three percent of the population. They're going and they're going. Like they don't, they don't even go to Costco, and like now they're going to Costco and picking. Yeah, it up. I, I want to be like you guys they're are not even members. Yeah, they're opportunists, <laughs> you know, and they go buy a bunch and they they're like, remember with Tickle Me Elmo, mm -hmm. and everybody wanted Tickle Me Elmo, oh, and it's like, dude, gosh, Tickle Me Elmo is yeah. the dumbest toy, dude. Got one. You got you one. You got one. Yeah. Do you still have it? Yeah. Is it in no. a box? Did you have? No. Did you make Tim go buy it when nobody <laughs> could get it? No, we lived in Florida. I went out in the morning and tried to get it because Cody. That's when Cody was born, and and so I couldn't get it in Florida. So I called my mom in California. Woke her ass up early in the morning and said, "You need to get up." So she you, went up, and got one. Yeah. You did that to your mom? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nancy. What? This is a. I could talk about three hours on this subject alone. <laughs> what? So 
Okay, like you, you're like, you're watching the news, right? And like, we're they're, they're, like, how? It's just Kyle, right? Or Cody? Cody. Okay, so, so Cody's being. <laughs> Cody's being what? Cody, so you, you're watching the news and you're like, okay, I'm gonna, have, I have my son, and like, how old is he? He was an infant. He was just born that year, so it was so his first you, Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> so, you could have got, got a TV ring and a cardboard box, and the boy would have been happy, right? Oh, I didn't care about that. I, yeah, exactly. Oh, we're trying to figure. Yes, trying to think. right. Oh, so if you're gonna come at me because I bought my one-year-old <laughs> son, and oh, he's not even gonna flip and know what the hell it is. You're right. You're absolutely right, and, and I don't care. <laughs> Got one, anyways. No, 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 no. So. Like you're sitting out, you're not getting off that easy. So you're sitting oh. out. You're, you're, you're sitting at home. Like, like what city in uh, in Florida is this? Altamont Springs. Where's that close by? Orlando. Okay, so <laughs> close to Disneyland, right? So you got the spirit of the Magic Kingdom moving over. No, you. we're not. See, we didn't live near that. See, that's why we didn't live where we lived. We didn't li- want to live near the rat. That was the a spirit. The spirit of the So the, so so the fire was bad. Was it off like, like, is it nighttime or daytime when you the first time you heard a tickle be elbow? What? Is it nighttime or daytime? The first when? time you hear the word tickle me elbow. The first time I heard it? Yeah. I have no I really you want me to <laughs> Real. So you hear, really? you hear, you hear. Really? Uh, I was just wondering if the if the fireworks are going off in the back of Disney, like so. It maybe it was like okay, like okay. Well, she saw fireworks and the TV's going and telling her to buy tickle me Elmo. So the wizardry was going coming over. Her. Oh, right. That's, okay, so she's like feeling your forehead. Get, get that at, part quickly, please. You're looking at, you're, you're looking at, at a baby, you know. You see Cody crawling, and like the fireworks are going off, and like Channel Twelve News is in the background. They're like, "Hi, ah, live from Orlando." <laughs> I think it is. Tickle me, Elmo is rare. And so, like, well, no, it of... wouldn't because that's Disney, and, to, and that's Sesame Street. It's different. You're going. See, you got that one wrong. I wanted <laughs> to see where he was going with it. I know. <laughs> so you totally like... just fell down. Bro. Right, no, I I'm, I'm <laughs> trying to see. I'm. Tr- I'm trying You're to trying. see the You're trying. You keep trying. The feeling. The feeling. How come you couldn't get it in Florida? They were sold out. I went to Target. It was a oh, it was a madhouse. That was uh, the that was the first and last Black Friday I ever did. <laughs> like never again. <laughs> and that was, was what like, was, 19, there grabbing, was there people 90. grabbing like five tickle me elbows at a time? Yeah. My mom, after she got home, she goes, I should have got two. She goes, I could have sold the other one. Right. Yeah, Yeah, exactly. (laughs) Choking. They're probably worth a lot still right now. Didn't they bring it back out? That that was my point. It's like the second Christmas (laughs) was over. Yeah, they brought it out. (laughs) The second Christmas was over, you could get a tickle me elbow everywhere, dude. Yeah. (laughs) It's no big deal. Like, like, for one, remember remember when Nintendos were hot? Mm -hmm. Nets and you, and if you guys, you couldn't find Nintendo, like for Christmas. But then, like when Christmas was over, Nintendos were everywhere. It's like everything, everything that comes out, right? The PlayStation Four, Xbox, all this stuff you can't get. Yeah. Yeah, So the first time I learned my, I should have learned my lesson at Nintendo, but I didn't. It was at Tickle Me Elmo. That was the only point that I was like, Maggie was like, oh, and Nancy did it too. So my my whole point is like, we all learned, dude, from Tickle Me Elmo that this that's the dumbest. So what fireworks did you have? Huh? <laughs> what set what you fireworks off? did you have? What no, was... so so there was a girl. Well, I had fireworks to... in my story. <laughs> so there was a girl we went to high school with, and uh, she got tickle me Elmo the day after, and she brought it. You know, like either I think before, and somebody had like heard it or broke it, and they're like, "I promise, I guess you a new one. Like, just gonna take me until like the first or whatever." And like nobody believed the guy, and then he got the tickle me Elmo, and it was everywhere. And he's like, yeah, there's like a hundred of them. At <laughs> <laughs> like that's what I knew, and I was like, yeah, it was yeah. very because the girl was so devastated about this tickle me Elmo, and the guy was like cool about it. He's like, no, dude, I know I can get you the tickle me Elmo. Yeah, you understand? So okay, that's what I do, dude. Like every time they do that, there's going to be so much of it, and so that's what they're doing with the food. They're pulling this whole 
Tickle Me Elmo shenanigan. Oh, there you go. Thank you. <laughs> hey, there. We're full circle. There it is. Full circle. We always, I always go full circle. I, <laughs> That's, I ride bikes. I ride... Oh, man. I wonder how many... You guys want to take over or under how many times I fall? One and a half. That you what? Fall. That you I fall. fall. Yeah, fall off the mountain, what? Off off the mountain bike? bike? Oh, where are you mountain biking at, though? Working? Are you actually going somewhere, or are you just, like, on the street? No, that doesn't count. That's what I'm saying. It's on the street, zero. If, if I'm street biking, dude, and I fall, dude, I'm never, I'm never running. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Can you get a, a camera on your head, please? Dude, I'm going to put it. I, oh. I have a GoPro. GoPro. Yeah. Yes. Yes, yeah. please. You need to just walk around with the GoPro on your head no matter where you go. I've been telling you this. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh, I just need to have Lily. I just realized, dude, is I can have Lily go with me. Dude. That'd be funny. <laughs> Lily can go everywhere with me. She's at my road dog anyway. You want me to send you Gabe? No. Because keep the, trying to he's send Gabe. What's wrong with Gabe? I, would, I, would, I would ruin him, dude. He'd be so upset. <laughs> having to deal with me day after day. <laughs> Why do you want to get rid of Gabe? Oh, I don't. But you know, I just want someone Gabe, to Gabe's be able. To, favorite, I want someone to be able to film him. And Gabe's just good. Oh. He just knows how to okay. do things. <laughs> yeah, 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 right. Gabe will fix my life. Actually, yeah. all my stuff will be. Well, yeah, then maybe you do need to send him because he's like in a <laughs> downward spiral. So I was. It's like, it's like I should, as I'm a fallen dude. Get out of that room, man. I yeah. am. I literally, it's not like I haven't been out of the room. It's just like I haven't been out of the room enough. I miss everybody from my gym, you know. Yeah. My kids haven't been able to exercise. I'm not going to spiral about it, dude. And like, our freedoms are eroded. The worst thing of all. Yeah. That's all. Well, why don't whatever. you bring the girls over here and we all walk these hills together tomorrow? You need to start. Yeah. You know. Start thinking of things, doing different things. Just start doing different things oh, for right now. I'm moving to Florida again. Move to Florida. I'm not moving to Florida. Florida Naples, dude. I want to be on the beach. There's no way I'm moving <laughs> to Florida. Huh? I mean, there's no way I'm moving to Florida. No. Hated it when I was there. I'm never. But Las back. Vegas is obviously dead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm never like uh, that's off the table. <laughs> Literally. Right. Yeah. It's going to be closed forever. I think Vegas is going to hurt the most out of this. Vegas has 49 million visitors a year, okay? And I think I read that most of them come in these next few weeks, dude. Like a lot, a, a big percentage. Because right, it's spring break. Spring break, Memorial Day, it's before it's too hot, uh, all oh, those yeah. things. Like NFL there's draft. so much money on the draft, and there's all that money on that uh, draft. Right. Uh -huh. Just the draft alone, they were getting hockey close to a million people. I know it's amazing, dude. Mm -hmm. How much? How many people they were gonna get? They're, they're estimating over seven fifty, seven hundred fifty thousand people. I believe that for the three days, three or four four days of the draft. So, and how are people in Hawaii surviving right now, dude? If all and, the shipping stuff is down, let's go too. Let's go as a. Uh, I don't have, there's like not one case over there, I don't believe. Mexico. <laughs> See, dude, I always, guys, I'm going to tell you something. I always had a sneaky suspicion that the wall is to keep us from getting into Mexico. I, 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 did. I always had that, I always had that sneaky suspicion. They say they want Trump to hurry up and build the wall so we don't go over there anymore. <laughs> is that what they really said? Yeah, well, that's. That's the memes that I see. Oh, the, me oh, the memes? Like, <laughs> I see the Jeff Goldblum meme where it's like, you did it, you crazy son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, I, I, uh, I've been on the computer too much. That's what one thing I don't like is I've been looking at my phone too much. I've been on the internet too much. It's, yeah, it's not good I for you. Do. I don't have the TV. I don't, I, I don't watch it. So that's part of my process. <laughs> you, oh, you just keep it on? No, I, I don't watch it. I don't have it on. The only time it's on is when Tim comes home. Then it comes you on. Don't, you're not big on like looking at videos on your phone or anything, right? You don't do that, huh? No. Too much? Yeah, I don't. Yeah. No, I'm you, that. Yeah. Remember, I'm busy. I respect old. that about you. Old. I didn't have this technology when I was your age. <laughs> you're not old. 
I just, I just miss my sports. Yeah, I feel uh, sorry for you guys. You guys, you know, <laughs> no sports. You want to talk about the NFL? The NFL is the only thing that keeps going a little bit. At least gives us a you little know what, bit of hope. We haven't even talked about what the Oakland Raiders did, dude. Wow. How are you feeling, bro, about these moves? Uh, I like them so far. I don't see why not. I think we should go pick up uh, Todd Gurley and just have him back up Jacobs. He's not, obviously doesn't need a heavy workload. Be a perfect little punch, dude. No, we need to. Honestly, if we can get, I've told you this, dude. We need to get Johnson Taylor Thomas, dude. Like Jesse says, we could. We might from, be able. Uh, we, Tennessee. Is he from Tennessee? No, 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 no. I'm thinking of this other guy. I'm thinking of a corner. I'm thinking of this corner from Tennessee right now. They're, they're I was kind of upset getting. that we didn't get Darius Slay, dude. He really wanted to come to the Raiders, dude. He wants too much money, though, man. They gave him fifty million. That's a lot of money for a corner. That's a yeah, lot of money for that. give, And that's true. Every time we give quarters that much money, do they suck? Yeah, that was a lot of money. So forget that. I'm glad we, we didn't fall for that. Hopefully, uh, Abram steps up, dude, and puts a little bit of pressure off the cornerbacks next year. Yeah, we got that cowboy safety. He's pretty good. We got a lot of a lot of cowboy guys. The the defense alignment from the cowboys, we got him. Um, he's pretty good. So no, I'm happy with the and, and we got the other dude that's really good, dude. What's his that uh all-star. He was an all-pro, dude, uh, from the Rams. Yeah, 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 yeah. Corey Littleton. Yeah, Littleton's balls, dude. We needed that linebacker. And I'm happy we got Mariota. I really am. Oh, oh that's the happiest move. I bet. I'm really you happy we what? got him. And I really I, – I enjoyed him in Oregon, and I just – I feel that, you know, he – I don't want to say he reminds me of Gannon, but the, he can run if he needs to. Everybody says, you know, he sucked, but Tennessee tried to make him into a pocket passer, and that's not what he is. You know, or what he, you know, that's not what he is. He got beat up so bad oh, dude. playing with uh, Tennessee. Mariota has to have an offense that moves fast. And that's what Gruden does. Right. And he that's, what Gannon, wanna, but that's yeah. what Gannon did, right? Gannon yeah. would go, oh, go, 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 go. Mariota is a master at the dink and dunk. You know, and that's what Gannon did. And he, did, you know, and he wasn't afraid to go deep when he needed to go deep. But he, and he wasn't afraid to pull the ball down and run for, you know, five yards and slide. Oh, God. Gannon was so good. Yeah, those are the good old days, man. <laughs> good old when we had, when, and the long ago when we had sports because sports won't last if there's no audience. Yeah, right. The, so yeah, what they're doing now? They're, they're doing a two night event at the Performance Center. Who? WrestleMania. That's so stupid. A two night event at the Performance Center. Obviously, no audience, in, and Gronkowski is hosting. I believe both nights. That's so dumb. Yeah, it's dumb. They should like, just wrestling it. is awful without the fans. It sucks, bro. It really does. Yeah, it's a, it, you're, so you're going to be making all those noises for who? Yeah, it was not good. I tell you who what, you yesterday, up? yesterday I was watching a little bit of the EEW side, and they actually had some of the wrestlers in the stands to make it a little bit more lively, you know? Well, that's <laughs> because cool. the, because at least, you know, WWE, they had no one. So it was just stupid. So at least these guys had, like, some of the, like, you know, whatever the storylines are, those guys sitting out you in know, the stands. You know, Vince could make it so much better. What they could do now that – I shouldn't even say this, because it's probably going to steal my idea. Dude, what they could do, dude, is, like, do it, like, in the jungle. And then do it, like, in like Street Fighter. Do it in the city. Do it, like, in front of a temple. You know, like, <laughs> didn't that be dope? <laughs> Like Street Fighter, dude. Just like Street Fighter. All these different events. They can make it. They could, dude. Instead of having it like as a show, mm-hmm. okay, they can make it more like uh, real life. Like, oh, uh, uh, John Cena hunted me down in the parking lot, and then, uh, <laughs> oh, dude, this I was on. I was in the airport, and this dude hunted me down, or like I was at my home, and he came knocking, or I was at the gym lifting, and he came, like, dude, they should make it everywhere the wrestlers go, dude. That's like more realistic now. Like they should write this whole coronavirus into what they're doing, dude. You know, like you're at the <laughs> hospital getting your vaccine, dude. Here comes the rock. Whack, dude. Here comes uh... <laughs> uh, I wish Eddie Guerrero would know how to pull it off, dude. Eddie Guerrero would be still alive. <laughs> oh man. Well, you guys, we've definitely said too much. Um I'll spot you uh, later. I'll spot okay. you later. Get you your workout in. Take, stay I'm pr- well. Hey, I'm proud of you guys, man. You I'm proud of you, Nancy. You're doing a great job. Killing you guys. 
I'll, stay I'll jump this up. Now I have to make sure I pay attention to you more. I'll be texting you more so you don't be all Debbie Downer all day. Okay? Yeah, I was right. Debbie Watch Downer out one day, it. dude, for a few hours, guys. Come on. Watch out. That's, uh-huh. pretty, good for, that's yeah. pretty good for, like, <laughs> what we're going through. I'm not drinking. I didn't know he was going through such a dark time right now. I'm not right. watching pornography. Come on, dude. I'm not doing any of the like, Downer Maybe Downer Maybe you should stuff. Maybe you should. I literally laid in my bed. Smoke porn, smoke a joint, have you know, have have some little me time. I'm trying not to smoke that much weed right now. Maybe you should. That's your problem. I probably should, right? Yes, yeah, you should. Please do. You guys, is that what you guys you guys vote for me to smoke? <laughs> oh, is that what you're trying to do? Is dummy dog, you wizards? Coronavirus <laughs> going on over there? All right. Okay. Take care.